In the realm of true crime, some names echo louder than others. Among these, John Floyd Thomas Jr. lurks in the shadows, a specter of darkness swirling around a chilling legacy. Today we delve into the life and crimes of this man, whose actions have left an indelible mark on the annals of criminal history. Born in 1936 in Los Angeles, California, Thomas's early life was marred by tragedy. His mother died in childbirth, and his father was subsequently convicted of a felony. This set the stage for a life that would eventually spiral into a dark abyss of crime. Thomas's criminal activities began in the early 60s, with a series of burglaries and sexual assaults. These initial acts were just the tip of the iceberg, a mere precursor to the reign of terror that was to follow. His modus operandi was chillingly consistent. He would break into the homes of elderly and lone women, sexually assault them and often leave them for dead. In the mid-70s, Thomas's crimes escalated. His targets were no longer just victims of opportunity. He began to stalk and meticulously plan his attacks. His victims chosen with a cold and calculated precision that sent shivers down the spine of the City of Angels. In the late 70s and early 80s, the frequency of Thomas's crimes began to wane, leading some to believe that the reign of terror had ended. But the lull was merely the calm before the storm. In the mid-80s, Thomas returned with a vengeance, his crimes becoming more brutal and his victims more numerous. In the late 90s, Thomas was finally apprehended and brought to justice, but not before he had left a trail of destruction in his wake. The number of his victims is still a matter of speculation, with estimates ranging from 17 to well over 100. The impact of Thomas's crimes was profound, leaving a community in fear and a city in shock. His reign of terror lasted for over three decades, a grim reminder of the darkness that can lurk in the hearts of men. The tale of John Floyd Thomas Jr. is a chilling testament to the depths of human depravity. A man whose life was marked by tragedy, he chose to inflict that tragedy upon others, leaving a legacy of pain and fear that will forever haunt the annals of true crime. In the end, the story of John Floyd Thomas Jr. is not just about the crimes he committed, but also about the lives he ruined and the fear he instilled. His story serves as a stark reminder of the darkness that exists in our world and the necessity of justice in bringing such darkness to light.